So I'm uh, doing uh, interviews for Entertainment Studios. Oh, let me just interview Slate. And sure. Star. Okay, you. great. Okay, first of all, hi, Scott Mance from Entertainment Studios. Right. First of all, John, I mean, this movie is not what I expected. Oh, great. And I mean that in a good way because uh -huh. I thought it was going to turn into like sort of like a, a pet cemetery for like people, uh -huh. you know, like, like Nora isn't herself these days. Right, right. But that's not what it is. Uh -huh. What can people expect from replicas? Well, they can expect a, a, uh, a, they can expect the question of whether or not we should prematurely kind of dictate whether something ends or not, or, or get in the way and, and interfere with nature taking its course, whether or not we should say goodbye to someone prematurely. And all of the twists and turns after saying, yes, this is something I must do, and all of the twists and turns that take place after making such a profound decision. And, um, and it's filled with thrills, and it's filled with, 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 with scary moments, it's filled with humor, it's filled with unex uh, unexpected um, outcomes. It's f exactly. It did not go where I thought it was going to go, which is always great when a movie can be unpredictable and surprise you, which this does. Right. But the other thing about this film, too, is that, like you said, uh, it does present a morally complex dilemma that mm -hmm. like you care about. You care about these people. Mm -hmm. You care about the fosters. Yeah. Like, what is it about, like, Keanu and Alice that makes you really empathize with, with their characters? Yeah, well, I, that's, that's I'm, sh I'm sure, one of the main things that director and Keanu and Alice wanted to explore with the children was that these are people who um, who are a family and that there is real genuine love between them. Mm -hmm. And when you start there and if that's established, then that's something that everyone's going to relate to and care for and root for. Well, with, you know, in Keanu's case, you know, he's done movies in the past mm -hmm. that are plugged in so to speak, mm -hmm. uh, Johnny Mnemonic, obviously The Matrix. You know, this film, again, it's it's more emotional. And I yeah. felt like, uh, you know, Keanu, uh, performance-wise, was, was fantastic. Yeah. You know, yeah. How, I mean, you do yeah. have a lot of great scenes with him. Was it yeah. like, you know, working with Keanu Reeves? Yeah, he's great. Yeah, exactly. It's a it's a real emotional roller coaster for him in this, in this movie. I think he, um, what I love about him is that he's, um, he truly cares about the work and is is 100 percent committed to the truth of mm -hmm. it you know so he's gonna give it his all you know he's not gonna leave anything anything to himself he's gonna completely just give it over to it and um, and that needs to happen for a role like this to live you know watching this film you know like in the past maybe like 10 or 15 years there have been stories that you see about oh cloning a dog you know, and we're not that far off from what yeah. we're seeing here, are right, we? Right, right, right. Yeah, this thing can happen tomorrow. Wow. You know, <laughs> I mean, it's like, and and we may kind of sense that, but when it's revealed, it's going to be uh, pretty scary. The thing that makes this movie so relatable is the family aspect. Mm -hmm. Because everybody watching this film is going to ask themselves, what would I do? What would mm. I do yeah. if I was in... His position. Yeah. What yeah. Would you do? Yeah. Well, what I, I, you know, I'm torn, you know, I'm torn because I, 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 I would like to think that as hard as something may be, if it happens, it happens and we have to move on. And there's a greater reason for, for that happening. But if I'm in such, a, such pain about it and it's so unjust, if it is unjust, then I want to prolong it. Sure. I yeah. want to get in there. You know, you're asking yourself the same question that yeah. you've asked at the top of this conversation. Yeah. You know, did we, did we yeah. do it? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, but exactly. And, I, and, 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 and I think that's what audiences are going to hold on to, you know, are those questions, you know, because it's, it's so relatable. And I think having the family at the center of it is, is, is really smart. Well, congratulations. Great work. Oh, thank you and so really much. Nice to meet thank you. you. Thank you. Pleasure so much, meeting you. Pleasure. Yeah.